we have a company with the uh, 40th uh, Expeditionary uh, Signal Battalion here on Range 1 Bravo on Fort Huachuca. This is a uh, defensive fire range, meaning they get an order to go out and occupy a, a spot, set up their satellite dish, get ready to do communications, and while they're doing that, they're going to dig fighting positions to protect themselves. Uh, they'll simulate a, uh, an attack at, both during the daytime and at nighttime. Uh, we're doing a defensive live fire scenario. Uh, so our scenario is based off we're on a FOB uh, along with other maneuver elements and we're defending a sector of fire. So we just did a section iteration where we have three teams reporting to one section sergeant. And then that section sergeant reports to his or her PL platoon sergeant and reports up to the company commander. It is flexible. We could do all kinds of different uh, training scenarios on this particular range. It's rated for both uh, 50 cal and uh, 5.56 five, uh, plus Mark 19 40 millimeter grenades. So we feel like this, uh, this range definitely enhances our, our range capability at Fort Huachuca and uh, hopefully this will uh, attract uh, other units to come here and, and use the range to uh, accomplish their training objectives. So the realism, I have to give kudos to the garrison in Fort Huachuca for being able to come out and help us build a new range uh, to support this training objective. It's a little bit more flexible. It gives them uh, a little bit larger field of fire for them to, to shoot at with various different weapon systems, whereas most ranges, are, most static ranges, are for one weapon system and one weapon system only. We've gone through it at least four times from today and yesterday. Uh, with the real rounds, is quite scarier, but at the end of the day, we still have to do what we have to do, so we just got it done. You want to have as much realism and training as possible, and so setting up this range in this particular environment right here is a very realistic thing, something that they would do in theater. It was a very adrenaline rushing feeling, shooting live rounds. The 249 going off right next to me. The responsibility of being an RTO, so I'm still a little shaken, but it's still it's fun. It was fun. Uh, we built this range for the 40th, specifically for this uh, particular training objective, because they were having to go to uh, Fort Bliss to complete this portion of their training. So we want them to stay here, save Army money uh, for travel costs, and uh, we, we felt like we could accomplish this here and uh, get everything done in one fell swoop. We're getting ready for real world missions, and uh, our soldiers will be ready to provide ready, reliable communications and fight the enemy. Good leadership. Good. Good training. I hope All it'll right, help me one day. Go. 